Hello and welcome to the technical webinar series hosted by Victor Davis. My name is Bishwaroof and I am senior MDM architect. In this webinar, we will demonstrate the installation of product 360 core and supply portal. This can be useful for data consultants with no hands-on experience with the tool. Download the software from Informatica Park portal. Then extract the zip file in your desired folder. I'll recommend you to create a new folder and extract there. Make sure that you have four files to be extracted. Those four files are Cluster X Win64 full zip, DB Setup Client Win64 full zip, Server Win64 full zip, Client Win64 full zip. To run the DB Setup script, create the server.properties file and enter the details about the database and choose the file when system prompts. Please refer Informatica Product 360 manual to know details about the parameter. Log on to your database server and check if the tables are created. To install ClusterX, go to Extract Tech folder called ClusterX, then right click on Install and click Run as Administrator. Go to Tax Manager and check Service Named Informatica MDM Product 360 Control Center. Right click onto it and, and click on start. Set the startup type as automatic and click on OK. Now open the classic console from browser. Generally it runs on port 9000. Once logged in, click on Deployment tab and from the File Action area, choose the zip file for PIM code installation. After selecting the file, click on Upload. Once the file is uploaded, choose the file and click on Install. Once the server is successfully installed, check in the Services. After PIM code installation, install ActiveMQ. First, download softwares from Park Portal and extract it. To install, run setup64.bat as administrator. To configure PIM code with ActiveMQ, modify the files ActiveMQ.xml, jtrealproperties, wrapper.conf, and server properties in PIM code. Please refer PIM installation manual for details. Once done, run PIM server from ClusterX console and monitor the log file. After successful start, log on to PIM server using browser. Now to install Supply Portal, download the software from Park Portal and extract the same in a folder. Change the configuration.property file and then execute setup.bat file as administrator. For more information regarding configuration, please refer to Informatica installation manual. Once database configuration is completed, open the database and check.
open pim desktop client and create users and user groups for supplier portal Follow PIM installation manual for more details about users and user groups. Change agency.properties properties in PIM, configuration.properties and context.xml from supplier portal. Also change the server.xml file from supplier portal. Create and configure the supplier portal service. Check from the services the supplier portal is running or not. If not run, run the supplier portal service and then log on to the supplier portal from the browser. Hope you have enjoyed. We will come back soon with more advanced feature using Informatica Product 360. To know more, or if you have any questions, please reach out to our MDM team at Victor Davis. Thank you for watching the webinar.